Hello, I'm Daniel Bradshaw, Chief Technology Officer at Airspace Link. We hope you're enjoying the conference. And thank you for spending a few minutes with us today. Drones enhance many aspects of today's society with applicability in energy, agriculture, logistics, healthcare, emergency management, and much more. Pilots and the communities they fly in find it challenging to communicate with one another. For pilots, there are complicated rules and regulations they don't always understand. Where are scheduled events that would affect planned operations? What are the active emergencies that may affect safety while in the air? For government, let's start with the basics. Where are the areas where you can and cannot fly? Where are flights actually happening? How should drones operate in your community? Airspace Link is designed to answer these questions and provide a bridge between pilots, local governments, and the UAV industry, enabling the expansion of complex flights, package delivery, and advanced air mobility in the near future. Today, we're going to demonstrate three applications that are part of our AirHub product suite. AirHub for pilots, AirHub for government, and AirHub for business. Let's log into the AirHub for Pilots web app, and I want to create a flight for some photography in Taylor, Michigan. This will be under the Part 107 rules. You'll notice my data is already loaded from my user profile, and in this case, I think I want to fly around 300 feet. Now, of course, one of the most important parts of defining new operations is the flight boundary. Let's start by targeting the area where I'm going to operate today. And this is where our system starts to bring value to help you understand the rules about where you're operating. This could be limitations or other restricted airspace. Here the red shaded area on the map denotes additional air traffic approval is required, which I may not have time to wait for today. But I also need help in understanding what's happening on the ground or what's happening in real time in the community. At the moment, there's a 911 call in progress. So I'm gonna make some adjustments to my flight plan based off of both this local information as well as some FAA data. After that, I'm going to apply for authorization and you'll see that we'll be able to receive that authorization in near real time. Airspace Link is one of only six companies in the US approved to authorize both commercial and recreational flights with the FAA. Now that I'm approved, I'm going to quickly explore through some of this local risk data. You can see some hospitals and helipads exist up here, and I'll need to be extra cautious when operating in this area. But how does all this data get here? Let's jump over to our AirHub for Gov portal. This is the tool local governments use to publish the authoritative data to pilots and where jurisdictions manage ground-based risk as well as advisories. Now advisories are all about those things that are in flux in your community. Let's create a new farmer's market advisory. It's a seasonal market and might change dates, but let's go ahead and schedule for every Tuesday and Wednesday. Now, perhaps it is as simple as this market or as complex as an active 911 emergency. I've just hit publish. This farmer's market will now be made visible to pilots in just a few moments. We also provide data about what's happening within the community, how many flights are happening and when and where. This creates a feedback loop between pilots and their communities. But let's jump back over to the pilot app. You can see that the farmer's market just populated with the application. And as a pilot, I can now take the necessary action or communication steps. AirHub for Business is an API product for supporting broader commercial uses such as package delivery. This is a simple interface put together to demonstrate the concepts. Consider this basic flight from point A to point B. A system would pass in the desired destination and our platform will optimize the routes based on Airspace Link's aggregate data sources. While the interface is simple, all of the pieces come together to help make automated decisions based on both spatial and temporal data, including risk and advisor data from both federal and local sources, as well as social media feeds. The risk profile of the operation affects the routed outcome. Along the way, you may need to generate reports to understand the impact your operation is having. This may be necessary to create a safety justification based on on-the-ground information, people, homes, demographics. This is important if creating safety cases for the FAA. 
Now, keep in mind, AirHub for Business is intended for developers. It's an API-first approach to developing community-aware UAS applications. As an Esri business partner, Airspace Link is well positioned to work with organizations on any data needs you may have, including the majority of all state and local governments. You'll also find the products we discussed today on the ESRI Marketplace. Come check us out. Thank you again for taking a few minutes to review the AirHub platform. Schedule a full demonstration using the contact details to follow.